We continue to bring you the facts, not fear, about the pandemic. The Florida Department of Health is reporting 4,423 new cases of COVID-19. 32 more people have died after testing positive. That means almost 17,000 people have died since early spring. 2,485 people were hospitalized in Florida. Of those, 621 are here in the Tampa Bay area. And across the country, more than 91,000 new cases of COVID-19 were reported yesterday. It's the second time it's been this high since the pandemic began. Data from Johns Hopkins University shows the nationwide seven day average of new daily cases stands at about 86,000. That's more than double what it was a month ago. And we learned today the 49ers shut down their facility after a player tested positive for COVID-19. This comes a day before San Francisco set to host the Packers. Now we did see an increase in the state's positivity rate. It stands at 7.75% from the more than 61,000 tests that came back from the labs. That's the highest it's been since mid-August. Remember that number should stay at 5% or lower for 14 consecutive days. You can find a breakdown of these numbers and keep up with the latest information on the coronavirus. Just text the word facts to 727-577-8522. We'll send that information right to your phone.